Hey, I'm Connor. And I'm Adam. We're you beer know. people. And uh, today we'll be reviewing the Summit in Summit's version, so the Summit Brewing Company's version of an Indian Pale L. Because I was, but um, it smells good. Also, for this those of you, who, for those of you who remember, uh, or depending on which order we post these in, uh, I used to pour, uh, but I. I Lost my uh, my head mojo, and so I can no longer put it, especially in that champagne flute that was the only glass that he had in his house. <laughs> uh, but so I, I've I've given up on that. We try again when we finally remember to actually buy like a pub glass or a mug or something to like where we can properly pour it. Uh, you want you want to go for this? I I sure smell. I, I like that smell. That's that's what I look for in the smell of a beer. I guess it smells like hot. Does it not smell kind of like a Mexican beer though? Like, no? I mean, there's, there are other it Mexican like beers that smell. Yeah, which, which is my favorite Mexican beer. Was it? Ah, uh, either that or Dos Equis. You know, did you know that a Tecate was in Dexter? I was watching an episode of Dexter. Product placement yeah, with I, Dexter. I seen Tecate, I'm like, oh, he's drinking a Tecate. Yeah, and for those of you, those of you who are jackasses and don't know, we're talking about adult Dexter, not Dexter's lab. <laughs> just, just so you know. But um, this Summit's Indian Pale Ale is 6.4% uh, alcohol. Which is pretty high for It's pretty high. I, we, we, we say that the average alcohol content is probably 4.5, but a lot of the most recent... like That's got to be average for, for what we do. I'm not sure. But like, like the, the average... Uh, like the beers most recently have been coming out like like Budweiser Platinum and stuff like they're all like five or six. I mean it's, it's, it's six it's six point four, so it's a little higher than it's a, the it's average a, it's beer. It's a tad high. It's not. But like, uh, I think I think the the four point five is mostly the li like light beers. Yeah. Might be. Like I so, I think I think five is average. I feel five like anything anything higher than five is is pretty high. The aesthetics of this bottle bear mentioning I really like. When 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 a bottle stands out, uh, that that makes me notice it more. Uh, Other, see the wheat. That means you can tell it's a wheat beer. And plus, it's it's squat and it's it's a little bit fatter. So they obviously than use wheat in it. But yeah, that's that's and, and it it says somewhere on the side where it's it's malted wheat and malted uh, barley. Did you know that? I don't know if you noticed, but um, a lot of beers will actually have like. They're supposed to, they usually come with... I, I never have noticed. Yeah, like, if, like, That's depending on what's on the, like, you can see, like, it's a wheat beer, if it's a blah, 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 beer, so they usually have it on there. Yeah. But anyway, let's give it a taste. Oh, that is, that's a little, uh, depressing, that's what that is. That, that is intense, guys. Uh. If you're looking for beer that tastes like medicine... <laughs> that was gross. This is... Uh, this uh. is I, I, it tastes nasty. And I, it will not. The taste will not go away. Uh, this is very disappointing, guys. This is sick. I'm gonna. I'm gonna is no, I'll be honest with you. You know how much I paid for this, though? Three dollars. Yeah, three. It's like our two. It was two something. I was like, man, that's cheap for, for a, a six, six pack. pack. That's two for a dollar. This is a fifty cent beer. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, People making Mexican beer can learn something from <laughs> people making Indian beer. <laughs> or I wouldn't say that they can learn something, but uh, the Indian Indian pale ale is definitely in the running for for shittiest beer. Uh, <laughs> this is not. I'm I, I'm gonna have to try to drink this because I did. Do you think? Um, what was I gonna say? At least arrogant bastard. I was gonna ask. Do you think this is better than arrogant no. bastard? This. This is by far the most I mean, beer we've ever This arrogant bastard was at least I could I could tell that they spent this doesn't taste like this tastes like they didn't spend that. Yeah, arrogant bastard was a craft beer, so it was like they they painstakingly made it. So I mean, at least you could feel the effort. This is just like a whatever, just crank some fucking urine flavored beer out there. Nobody cares. Your your mind just be on in a beer factory, just pull the fucking lever. Let me tell you to. We can say fuck on YouTube, right? Yeah. Okay. I just don't think we'll be sponsored. Aww. You can bleep it out, though. Oh, yeah. Bleep. If we're worried about getting... Um, this, this is... 
It's mostly the aftertaste too. Like when I first drank it, it was completely bad. But my second, my second gulp, it was mostly aftertaste. But I mean, it's it's a terrible. It's the worst aftertaste I've ever had with a beer. I feel like I've tasted it like like a beer like this before, but I can't remember what it was. This is it's like they tried to make it citrusy and failed. Like like failed. Like it's kind of sour, huh? That's what I'm saying. It has like citrus notes, but they're not like citrus notes. They're like citrus notes. Like it's not lemon zest. It's like somebody shat a lemon into this and then just ground it to the bottom of the bottle. Um. All right, this is gonna make me sound like a noob. What? What's the difference between a dry beer and a non-dry beer? Oh, we should edit this part out because you shouldn't have asked me that question because I have no idea. Do not. <laughs> we can we can make a blooper reel after we've got fans <laughs> and put this in it. Because uh, I, 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 I on the, on the thing is that this is a, this is very dry, so I don't know what that means. I, I feel like in alcohol, uh, most of the time when they say dry, it means that there's not a lot of sugar content. It's not it doesn't taste sweet like you're used to. That's probably what it is. It's probably I bet you I bet you. Uh, this I, I can't put a number on this. I can't in good conscience give it anything higher than a one. So I'm just gonna say for my rating system, I would not want to meet the kind of person that drinks this voluntarily. This is not a good beer, and good people won't drink it. Uh, that aftertaste is man that gets me. Bearing this that is in not mind, good. Bearing that in mind, I, I'd like to try pale ale. It's, uh, it's Indian. If you would like. Uh, we will post the link below uh, if you wanna if you wanna go and get a case uh, or not a case. God, don't get a case. Buy one if you have to and drink it with us. Uh, but if if you have any intelligence inside of your this brain, not you will not drink it with us. You will sip as we sip and then go. Oh no, I see what they're saying. This tastes like this tastes like a deep fried hobo fart. Oh yeah, this is terrible. This is a. I'm I'm dumping this out. Yeah, Wait this. A minute. This yeah. is a bottle full of shattered dreams. Yeah, this is this is a gag beer. You know, you give it to make yeah. fun of someone. This is the main ingredient, and in this is not hops. Like, it's uh, probably syrup be like, like a Yeah, we we me and we have me rated this a ten. You should try it. It's really this good. is this Are we is like it it's like a <laughs> bottle of activated charcoal. This this is terrible. You know what's we. I'm kind of glad I got this because you know it's been a while since we hated a beer. I mean, there's been some beers. There's been a while since we both hated a beer. It seems like yeah. we recently did Corona, and I just would not. Oh, Corona it. wasn't. Yeah, Corona was. This I would rather drink Corona than this. That is how this is. This is our bottom, our bottom beer so far. If we had to make a top ten and a bottom ten, uh, the at, at the bottom ten, one being the worst beer. We this is definitely one. This is and it is, it is not really, a, it is, we, we have another Indian beer going up and I hope and I, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that it's, it's also a pale ale too. God. Fucking. I, I just hope that this is just, I just hope that this Indian pale, this India pale ale is bad because Summit Brewing Company is bad. How, how I, <laughs> I, I don't know. I feel like it bears <laughs> noting. I burped, and it's one of the best beer burps I've ever had in my life. That was a delicious beer burp. So I feel like most of whatever is bad stays inside your stomach. Which, actually, now that I'm thinking about it in those terms, I feel like I, uh, the gastrointestinal tract is going to be really damaged by this beer, but it'll taste really good when you throw up, so... Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> um. I can't. I can't. No, do it it's a one. <laughs> All right. Uh, drink responsibly. Yes. Drink. And by drink responsibly, we mean don't drink this because that's irresponsible. We've made a bad decision. Yes. Okay. Bye. Bye, guys. <laughs>